And in other news, one local museum is aiming to raise awareness of the dangers behind pesticides to the bee population after nearly half an exhibit's hive was killed. Last week, members of the Upper Peninsula Children's Museum noticed a sudden death of bees in an ongoing exhibit that is focused on teaching children about the impact on the environment. It was later determined from a beekeeper that the rapid death was due to some kind of poison, either a herbicide or pesticide. It's unknown who exactly caused the death of the bees, but it's assumed that nearby neighbors were using the chemicals on their lawn or plants, which were eventually brought back to the hive. While these deaths were unintentional, workers at the museum are hoping more people will become aware of the chemicals that they are using. It really makes me wonder about using pesticides at all. I think there are a lot of alternative forms of pest control. I think we as a society might need to really look at that because these are pollinators. They're, they're critical to our food supply. They're critical to who we are. So I think we need to be more aware of what we're doing. The beekeeper attempted to reestablish the hive and is hopeful that the remaining bees, including the queen, will be healthy enough to return to the museum in the next week. This exhibit has been a part of the museum for around 15 years.